kill. Did you not like the gift, Emperor? The the point is that by association we are guilty. We we can't You good? We can't do shit like that. You have a fucking hand. No, me too. Oh, no, no. Okay, well I'm then, just, I mean, don't say that. But it's just doing really heavy shit that involves the police. <laughs> like, breaking in. Is, you good? Should be off limit. Yeah, I'm okay, I'm okay. Because they can get rated for that. I mean, doesn't, I guess it kind of depends. If you want to go on that kind of thing, then that's your choice and we can't stop you. But it kind of depends on if you want to be involved with our stuff or not, I guess, right? It's, it's like, it's like if I gave boss my gun. And the police find it, they're going to raid me. Because they, they're gonna be thinking I'm supplying him with guns. Like that's probably what's gonna happen. I think I the, know. the the spike strip shit would probably also link back to him, even if it doesn't seem like it would or should. I mean my fucking bike the the officers literally like make jokes about how their my bike's gonna get crushed even though I that <laughs> it's had a fake plate and has been stolen each time like it's just we can't take the risk also i don't think that door's locked what do you want to be involved with my friend you like you like this reckless uh, life you're living because if so that's totally okay but it's going to exclude you from other things you might want to be involved in I mean, I have give me, give me part of second. it anyways. Because you chose not to, motherfucker. You chose not to. Um, yeah, Mia Fury, and I, I don't know what you guys talked about on the phone, but I thought you didn't want to do this stuff. I thought you wanted to be, like, I remember I the said super, be like a super clean man. I said it'd be a lookout or whatever. Remember? You remember that, well, we're right? not. We're not talking about, we're not talking about cooking skooma. Oh, I just said I never wanted to kill anyone. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Yeah, that's not. That's what's happening. Oh. We're, we weren't just cooking meth right now. We were. We just kidnapped someone and killed them. We thought you didn't want to do that. I'll do other stuff, but I don't want to kill someone. That's. What do you think this is? Stormlord's I, asking us to do this. I I don't know. I thought we'd do other stuff or something to fight corruption, but I don't. I don't want to kill anyone. At least I'm an innocent. Well, you don't necessarily have to do that to be involved. But what if yeah, the Storm Lord to. told you to? I'd be very conflicted. Would you do it? I don't know. You know, I'd say... So, I didn't think... I didn't like killing innocent people either, and I still don't like doing it, and I'd prefer not to. But... Personally... When we grab someone, I think to myself, yeah, these guys are probably some sort of asshole. And then you stab them, and then it's like whatever at that point, right? I'm sure if you don't want to be involved in that side of things, you know, you could talk to the Stormlord, and he could set you on a path where you don't have to do something like that and still serve him. Do you still want to serve the, the Stormlord Mafia? That, he doesn't, that's, I guess, the biggest question, right? He I doesn't want, want to wanna... kill innocent people. Yeah, I just don't want to kill innocent. That's the okay, only part Okay, but I you're said. robbing houses. What happens if there's a person in that house pointing a gun at you? And if you don't kill that motherfucker, you will die. Well, I went into the wrong house, I think. So you, you would, would choose let them death. kill you? Well, I mean, I'm kind of wrong breaking into their house, but I don't want to hurt anybody. So why are you breaking into their house in the first place? To make a living. I've been pretty down pretty bad. Okay, so they wake up, pull a shotgun from their fucking... under their fucking pillow cover, and point it at you, and you have three seconds to kill them, or you die. Like, I, I wake... I walk into them? What? You have three seconds to kill them, or you die, my friend. What are you choosing? Three. Okay. Two, one. So you would choose death. Bang. Probably. 
okay? I don't want to You're peddling weed in front of Mission Row PD. One of the locals walks up and decides to shank you. You have three seconds to react or you die. I'm going to run you away. You cannot run. What do you mean he's got a knife? I'm running. He's just going to run, run, follow you, stab he's you in your fucking he's got bag. He's trapped in the corner. All he can do is pull your gun and shoot him. What do you choose? Uh, I'm going to tackle him and then run away. If you tackle him, you'll tackle him to the knife and die. Yeah, you let me tackle you up into the knife. No, Furion, it's... What? I mean, this is why. Yeah, you... Seems as you're, if you you're, want you're to choosing have... to get into a life of crime, but you're not willing to do whatever it takes to, to survive in this world. Now, Furion, you think you're going to live in a perfect world where the situations would never happen. Yeah, it sounds like you want to have uh, one step, one, one foot in and one foot out. You can't have both. You have to go all in or nothing at this point. Hey, Miafirin, how about this? We're breaking into a house. Uh, and there's another guy, like, we're breaking into a house and the owner's there. He's going to kill me. Are you going to save me? Wait, why is he going to kill you, though? Because we broke into his house and he is about to kill me in three seconds. Do you shoot him <sighs> or do you fuck. let me die? Oh, fuck. I shoot him. Why'd you do that? Because I don't want you to die. So you'd risk your own life for the over our, uh, right? I mean, I'll save you guys, but I just don't want to kill a guy because to save my own ass. That seems kind of wrong. I I understand where you're coming from. I don't like killing innocent people either. You obviously like it way less than I do. Uh, I can't blame you for that, but I think the Emperor could explain it better, why it's a necessity. I mean, it's not really a necessity, right? You just got to be willing to, uh, you know, be able to deal with any opportunity or, you know, disadvantage that comes your way, my friend. You can't be half in, half out, like go around saying. You don't live in that kind of world, my friend. Listen, how I would put it is I would protect others but if I'm ever in a situation myself where I'm going to get killed because of it, then I'd, I'd rather die than hurt someone. And why are you committing crime? Because I've been down bad and I need money. I don't know. Experience things. Learn. I have i don't know. There's nothing really else to really do. I don't know. You guys are always off doing stuff. I'm kind of by myself. Alone. Okay, yeah, because you choose that. Kind of. Not kind of. You do. When we first wanted to bring you into everything, you told me you were lawful good, and you don't want to be involved in any of the dirty uh, shit. Okay, the listen, you were I've never said I was lawful good. I said it was lawful yes, neutral. Yes, you did. No, no, no. no you I, said you were I'm, lawful good, motherfucker. No, no, lawful, no. lawful good is chut. Yeah, lawful good is chut. I've never said I was lawful good. I was more like lawful neutral. Okay, I don't give a fuck about this cringe scene. You said you didn't want to know about any of the fucking dirty shit we were doing, so we excluded you. That is what I, you said. I think... I think the confusion here is when you were on the phone earlier, Malfurion said that he wanted to be like a lookout and stuff for Skuma. But we're not excluding you from Skuma. We're not even doing that. We're barely doing Skuma. And when we do, we don't even use lookouts. Uh, yeah, honestly, we don't and even. It's not, it's not like we're doing this shit every day either. This is something we do very rarely. This is like the sixth time over like a month. Doesn't really know so me. You could be in. I mean, would you be okay with just standing there and watching as it happened? Like you're not going to, like, hey, you, you're not gonna rat, right? Uh, no, I think how I'd put it is, I don't know. I I'd, I'd be like a, a driver or help you guys out in a, like support capacity, but I don't personally want to kill somebody. Could you watch them die? I don't know. If you that's can't, hard. let's let's run this. That, that's hard. That's hard to say when you've never been in that situation where you're being told to watch someone die. You know. I, I mean, think that's any, fair. Any sane person will probably say no, but knowing what you guys are doing is probably for the greater good. It's it's hard to know. You know. So if we take you along, just to watch, right? That or some that other would, do any you other think, support. Do you capacity? think that would be necessary for you to, to understand if you're willing to do it or willing to be with us? 
Maybe, I don't know. We can if you're, you're, there, you're a guild member, you're, even if you don't want to do this shit, you're not, it's not like you're not a guild member. You know that, right? Yeah. Can I just do like training for other stuff, like other things, like in serve in a different capacity? I don't want to be like the tip of the spear, but maybe the handle that you use to reach that spear into somebody. But are you okay with being the handle? Are you okay with knowing that you are, uh, that you are enabling the blade? No matter your position in this, people are going to die. And even if you assist us and not personally do it, they will die with your assistance. That's tough. You have to understand you will likely be the reason someone that may be innocent dies. Completely innocent. Well, we can honestly, we can honestly test that theory. That I think Jaeger there's two said. people that have already died because of me. Do you feel bad? I do feel bad. Leave. Yeah. Well, I mean, they can, they like rock me. And then I think the emperors actually killed them, killed them. And I feel kind of bad. Well, they deserve that. Yeah, they they cross paths with the guild and the rooster and all their family. They deserve That's not it. really your fault. Right. But I mean, I was kind of upset and they, they died for that, you know? And I don't know. I still feel bad. Mia yeah, Furian, here's the thing, okay? We're worried that you're gonna do something fucking stupid and get us caught, is the bottom line. Are you doing stupid shit that will get us caught? Right, okay, so here's the thing. I'm doing stupid stuff, but it's just that my brain literally cannot process why people in this city Correlate what I'm doing to whatever random stuff you guys are doing. Because they're horny for a fucking promotion, Nefreon. Look what fucking Wrangler has done to us, right? Look what Bass has done to you because you listen in on some of his fucking investigations. Hmm. Okay? We had fucking Wrangler planting drugs here to try to get us raided. So fucking horny they are. But to clarify, Jaeger's not talking about robbing houses, fucking petty dumb shit, okay? He's talking about some serious shit, like breaking into a fucking cop car that got you fucked in the first place to steal spike strips. Yeah, Furian, I think you could pretty much do anything you want as long as it doesn't involve fucking with the police. Once you start fucking with the police is when they start taking action. Okay, then why were you upset at me the other time when I was running the candy stuff with Miss Claire? Because, motherfucker. Stuff? Running Oxy is called drug trafficking, okay? You work for me. You're my captain, okay? Oh, me and Freeman's running Oxy? Oh, he must be running Oxy for Lang. Oh, he's cleaning Lang's fucking money. Let's go rape everybody and audit the fuck out of Rooster's Rest. Oh my god, see, I just don't know how we connect these dots. And that's another thing, see, that's not just cops involved, that's other stuff. So how am I supposed to know? No, and to clarify that, that, we don't give a shit if you get caught running Oxy, but you're doing it with people who don't give a fuck about you. Right? If you're doing what with you Glorion, mean? we can trust that you and Glorion are going to do whatever it takes to have each other's backs and get out of there. Okay, you out here doing it with fucking random people who are going to fucking throw you in the best I haven't the minute they get random to. people. I've done it with, with, with just Claire. You told me you've done it with the angels, and the only person you said you know in there is fucking Claire. Yeah, the only person I've done it with Claire. That's it. That's literally it. The only person I've done it with. And personally, I don't see the issue in that. To be honest, I mean, we got past that issue, so I don't understand why he's even bringing this up. To be honest, but well, yeah. it's because <laughs> Jaeger was saying that as long as they don't do anything that involves the cops, but this is a thing that didn't involve the cops. But I'm getting, I mean, it does involve the cops, for, right? I'm, get, I'm getting heat for it. You got heat for it for two days and we moved on, Mary It's like clinging on to the past for some reason. It's really starting to bother. It, 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 it doesn't matter. This, this doesn't matter. It, the point is. Um, Unless, you know, maybe banks are a different story, right? Hey, Denzel, but... can you go check upstairs with whoever the fuck's walking around up there? I guess, yeah. Just make sure we're good. Yeah, maybe banks are a different story, but I don't think you're going to be in any trouble with doing Oxy. Or as, as long as you're not, like, have 40 fucking bottles in your 
exactly the spot. I don't understand why it's not working. Uh, this is a locker. Wait, this works. This one lock. I don't think it does. Hey, oh. that's pretty good. Okay, why is this not working? There we go. People are literally like afraid of us. Like. And they associate us with people like Mr. H and Uncle Pete, right? Like people, it's, it's different and you have to trust me on this because maybe Bjorn can uh, also chime in because he's talked to a lot of cops too. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, we're not just concerned about, uh, you know, that stuff blowing back on us. We're kind of worried that you're doing something that got you it caused you a lot of harm before as well with like going back to the PD. And, I mean, the major uh, concern here is your life and you getting fucked in the ass. Yeah. It just happened before. Because, I mean, that's what has happened with all that stuff before where you went through all that stuff and, you know, we were all pretty worried about you and then you're kind of putting yourself in the same situation for that potentially to happen again. Yeah, you're essentially doing the same thing over again. And you're not letting anybody know about it. So if you go missing, we have literally zero idea what the fuck happened to you. But in, like Jaeger was saying, the city guardsmen here seem to connect any dots they can if they really want to do something. So even though it may not seem that plausible, they will connect anyone they can to get what they want. And uh, they've kind of proven they will do that. And they might not do that, but uh, there's a good chance they will at least try. And so that's why we have to be very careful. Here's, here's your quest, Mephrion. Go on a ride along for a cop for an entire day. Okay? Entire day? Yeah, an entire fucking day. I want you to be right along with a police officer. That sounds really boring. It's actually not. It's actually really fun. No, cops are so boring. <laughs> I did it's a actually, ride along with a Wrangler for eight cool. hours, and it was a blast. I just did, did one. I did one with Lieutenant Angel today, and she oh, got like shot in the head. All right, boys. Let's uh, move on to to the other topic. Yeah, I got a I got a meeting. I got to head to. What other, what's the other topic? Uh, yeah, if you want to be here for this. Okay. You're not gonna snitch, right? You didn't really ask me that after the phone call I had with you? Yes. <sighs> Hold on. Me a Furian. What? What do you think of League of Legends? I think it's dog shit. Alright, he's back to normal. normal. <laughs> he's fine. He's good, boss. All right. Anyways, um, let's shift our focus to the DOC now, okay, guys? You guys got the greatest foot in on the fucking door. Start planning for it, okay? Oh uh, yeah. So, uh, me and Bjorn are going to be deputized, and Wait, we're what going about to me? be. Did she offer me too? Oh, yeah, yeah. Me, taser? me, me, Bjorn, and Malfurion are going to be deputized and be DOC uh, guards. And we're gonna go in there and learn about everything we can. Uh, and then for Uncle D's request, I think the person we grab from the DOC is- No, 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 that's separate. That's uh, just well, something I was talking separately. Well, what I'm saying is we have to grab one anyway. Why not get two birds with one stone? Yeah, let's do that. I like that. No, no, no. I like to make things personal, so. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, then that is a personal kind of guy. So uh, let's find a separate target. Let's start focusing on that. Finish the bovice mission. You guys get inducted, okay? Okay. All right, right, right. Well. Uh, with that said, members we probably of the fucking organization. Here. Let's work on that right now. Let's there. shift our focus right now. Let's fucking really press on that. We'll still do uh, random uh, hits on the delivery drivers, but we shift our you know priority focus to the DLC, okay? All right, and one all right, more thing. Well. I need all of you to help me with this. Um, pay attention around the city for X. His Lambo is 100% going to get repossessed because I refuse to believe he'll be able to pay it off. When it does, let me know. I want to buy it. All right, all right boys. Love you guys. Wang, do you have a second? Things. Yeah, what's up? I'll walk and talk with you. Where's he going to go? Yeah. Uh, remember what we were talking about? Uh, you, Rob, and I were talking briefly, or you and Rob were talking, and I was sitting there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, poison. Oh, please tell me you got your hands on it. So, hang back. It gets better. So not only, so it's got to say between me and you, not only can I get a steady supply from Sizz, uh, I also, you can poison anything in the city. Including burger shot, food, water, etc. You can okay. now just poison anything. Get my our hands on as much as we can. I don't give a fuck what I have to pay for it. I'll sink two hundred thousand if I have to. All right. Jesus Christ! All right, all right. And say, how do you get this? I'll fucking suck you off. I don't. Uh, no, I'm good. I don't need a blowjob. And do me a favor. Hmm. Take me up here on one of your trips and kill him on the back in front of him. See how he reacts. Do you want me to do that right now? Do it whenever you have time. Now, right, later. I'll just do it right now. I'll just go kill somebody. Take him on a trip. I can show him what this fucking life is, okay? How about I just make him kill an animal? Don't make him do anything yet. Do it in front of him first. Yeah, how but I kill an animal him. in front of him. Yeah. Listen, you gotta start everything... these fucks off small. You know, where... Like me, I killed somebody in front of her, dumped them off. You know? And then uh, from there, I made her eventually kill a dog because favorite animal. What's his favorite animal? I guess a cat. Probably a cat. Do that. I want to yeah, see I'll probably make okay? him shoot a fucking cat in the head. All right. Yeah, I'll take Let me know him how out. it goes. Yep. I love you. Love you too. Aw, oh, thanks. Yeah, I love you too, fucker. Hey, meow. Hey. We're gonna go. We're gonna go for a drive, buddy. You with me? Yep. You got a car, meow, or no? No. He's got a bike. All right. Come on. We'll go in my car. Oh, fucking God. How's your day been so far, meow? All right. Anything interesting? Hmm. I think right now. Why you say that? Well, Mr. Denzel, I have a feeling like this is the last time I'm going to speak with you. Why do you say that? <laughs> hey, uh, uh, girl just outside, a purple hair, leaning up against the wall. Uh, see if she heard anything. Soundproof uh, the floor, make sure she can hear anything, okay? Yeah, uh, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to just fucking take her somewhere? No, just get her name, see what she heard, see what the fuck she's doing there, let me know. And All right. then, uh, soundproof the floor. If you can hear anything through that floor, you find her, you grab her, you put her in the ocean, okay? Yep. Alright, love All right. you. Love you too. Okay, we need to test something. Hey, Glory, come here. I need you to go to the basement. I need I, you. Hold on, let me get it. I need you. I need <laughs> you to go. Oh shit, shit. <laughs> I need you to go to the basement. All right. And uh, did she just walk inside? Where did that pink haired bitch go? She works there. Who the fuck is she? Uh, she's new. She's Natalie. She was just leaning up against the 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 business. Oh. You see that? You see? I need you to go to the basement. And then just All start right. talking. All right. All right. For like like regular minutes. volume. Y yeah, right. regular or yelling. I hold tight. Then we're gonna go for a drink.
Hey, where did that purple haired chick go? Uh, she's inside. Alright. She's uh, one of our newer employees. And she was just leaning up against the wall. Just like this. Probably just waiting to get in. What's I don't her think name? She has keys yet. Uh, it's Natalie. Or something? Natalie Sumi? She's pretty new. She's been here for like, um, five or six days. Hello! Alright. I'm gonna have to go into my apartment for a little bit, but I should be back uh, a little bit later. Uh, All right. Uh, love you, bye, Bjorn. Uh, love but, you, uh, bye. Bye. Chant. Hey, 58k. Pong. Pong. And we're 40 away from the sub goal. Hell yeah, dude. This should be fun. With Meow. Let me tell Glory we're good. Are you able to hear anything? Nope. No? Nope. Alright. Okay. Yeah, I've been yelling for a while and walking in circles. Sounds good. All right, all right. Thank you. Bob. All right, meow. Let's go for a drive. Like Lorian. Like all I do with you. So what's your name? You know, besides meow. Uh, just meow for you. Do I at least okay. get like a final meal, Mr. Jinzo? What do you mean a final meal? That's right, you don't have to be coy, alright? I know you're gonna kill me right now. Uh, if I was gonna kill you, your brains would be splattered against the window already. That's what you want me to think. No, that's just. You'd be truth. more cleaner. You're bringing me out of the city. You you're really gonna think I'm gonna be more clean? You uh, you really think I give a fuck about the heat? Jesus yeah. Christ. No, I don't. Call Lang right now. That's pretty good. Call Lang right now and, and ask him would, uh, would Uncle D care about the heat? Would Uncle D kill me in broad daylight without taking course? Meow, if he's not picking up, uh, the simple the simple answer to that question is there is a picture of me murdering a man in broad daylight, and they uh, were taking me to, well, I, f I took it to court and I won the case, because I don't give a fuck, you know? If, you, if I wanted you dead, you'd be fucking dead. You do understand that, right? Well, I mean, that's the only thing I can assume, is that you're taking me out for a drive, we've never done this before. And your your job is to kill me right now. Why would that be the case? I don't know. Because the emperor doesn't like me anymore. It's not the case. Nah, he doesn't like me. He hates me. Uh, if he hated you, it would be slow. What do you mean slow? If he hated you, it would be a slow, painful death where I take both your pinkies. But since you're not going to die, he likes you a lot. Wait, so is that what's happening right now? You're just gonna take my pinkies? Nope. Okay, what are you taking? Nothing. I'm just gonna go for a drive. What do you do for fun, Meow? Mm, I 
play video games. What kind of video games? Final Fantasy 14, <laughs> World Warcraft. The fuck are those? They're MMOs. What the, what the fuck's an MMO? So like where you get like a lot of people online together and you play together. And you have like a, you know, you hang out. For most of the time it's like you're hanging out in a virtual city and just running around in circles. Because there's nothing to do. How's that fun? I don't know. Ask the 10 million subscribers. I'm asking one right now, am I not? Ask us as a whole. What? I don't know. Do you think I know? I don't. Why okay? do you do it? I don't know. I just run in circles around the city. Like, non-stop. You just get on a mountain, you just run in a circle. It just kind of happens. Instinct. Yeah, but why the fuck would anyone want that? I don't know. We're brainless. You like, uh, you know how to whistle? Yeah. Alright, I got a tune for you. I'm not that good of a, I'm not that good of a whistler. Uh, personally. So like, I, you, I'm gonna hum it, you're gonna whistle it, okay? <laughs> oh, fuck. I gotta find it. <laughs> you know Twisted Nerve? No. Oh uh, yeah, it's in the rooster. Oh. Yeah, I guess you didn't have all your motorcycles, huh? Yeah. Alright, Ray, well, it was nice knowing you. I don't know. Bye. I like the river. <laughs> yeah, the river's okay. You know why the river's nice? Why? Well, because... I mean, look right in front of us. See the animals drinking from the river. It's a lot of life along a river, right? Now, uh -huh. nice thing about a current is it goes one direction, right? Yeah. So, hop out for a second. That's pretty good. So you see how the river moves this way, Meow? Uh-huh. Hey, you ever taken a life? No. So, you see, uh, you see that, what is that, a boar or a pig? Yeah. So, let me explain to you. In life, there are people like me. Okay, look me in the eyes. I've killed a lot of people, Meow. Every goddamn day I kill a lot of people. I wake up in the morning. When I have cocaine, I do a line of cocaine. Hey, I smoke good. a cigarette. Walk out of my house. I do what I have to do to fucking survive. I put a bullet in somebody's fucking head. Do you think I give a fuck? Do you think I give a fuck if they're innocent, meow? Because I don't. I don't. You want to know why? Because I am loyal to my own. Do you want to know who my own is? Do you want to know who my family is? My family is back at their fucking rest. You want to know what I do for my family? Fucking anything. You know how many people I've broken down and made fucking soldiers, meow? Now look at that fucking animal right there, will ya? Take a look at that thing. See that? Do you think it knew oh what was God. coming? Do you think you knew what was coming, meow, huh? Huh? It didn't. Oh. It was innocent, purely innocent, just in the wild. Just drinking out of a fucking, what is this, river? Just drinking out of the fucking stream. 
Every goddamn thing in this world is fucking innocent meow until you take its fucking life. Get in the car! We just killed something. Get in. Let's go. Oh my God. Three. That's victim number one. It's just a boar. Eventually, there'll be another victim. And then eventually, there'll be a third. And then eventually, there'll be a fourth. And they all have names. Right? Eventually, eventually, you won't even remember the names. They'll just be numbers. Like, look at this. Just a buck running. Free in the wild. We could shoot it. We could run it over. We could do whatever the fuck we want to it. You know what you call that? What? You know what you call this buck? Call it a loose end. You know what we do to loose ends? <laughs> Look, a whole family of loose ends. <laughs> Look, they're all running. <laughs> oh my you know what we do to loose oh ends? God. Meow. We take care of them. Oh my god. Oh look! Meow! You know what we call this? Oh no, an innocent bystander that you leave alone? Another fucking loose end, Meow! You take care of everything you need to do! You kill what you've gotta kill! Because you know what, in this world, Meow, are you fucking hungry or are you a pussy that's just gonna get fucking shot? Huh? What are you, Meow? What are you? You knock on a fucking door, you open that goddamn door, you're gonna get shot in the fucking head? Huh? You just gonna let somebody kill you? You're never gonna see your family again. How do you think your family's gonna feel, meow? Huh? I don't know, but I'm You know, your family's gonna be upset that you just fucking rolled over and died like nothing, huh? How do you think Lang would've felt if years ago I just gave up and let them fucking execute me? I fought out of that shit. And look at me now, huh? Now I've gotta... Look at you. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta give you this little spiel so you don't fucking get yourself killed doing dumb shit. See, but I mean, that's, we're kind of different. I feel like you're kind of lost your humanity. Yeah, and you've got to lose your humanity. Why? Do you sleep at night, meow? Yeah. Would you sleep at night if you killed an innocent person every day? No. You eventually find a way to do it. And you're gonna find that one day. I don't know about that. You ever meet a woman named Mia? No. There's a woman named Mia. It was a uh, couple months ago. She came in for an interview at my company. And, uh, you see. She didn't know how to use a gun. I roughed her up during the interview. She knocked me on my ass with a hammer. We made her think we were gonna kill her. So we took her. To the middle of the windfields, made her get on her fucking knees. I put a gun to the fucking... You know, put a gun to her head, asked her if she was hungry. She said she was fucking hungry. So I shot next to her head let her live. Twelve hours later, she's never killed anybody before. She's never seen a dead body. I fucking execute somebody in front of her, make her dump the body. A day later, I make a stab two people for me. Next day, teach you how to use a gun. Kills three more people for me. And the bodies just keep coming. You wanna know? She had a hard, hard fucking time dealing with it. Goddamn hard time, but you know, with enough pressure, even the, you know, even somebody like you can turn into a diamond, meow. Mia, you think Mia was anything? close to a diamond before I started working with her? God, no. But afterwards, she killed a 20-year-old woman like it was nothing with no fucking remorse. Put the biggest smile on my face I've had in a long time. Now I ask you, Meow, are you ready? Because uh... you're an accomplice to all three of those murders we just did. You know that? Their blood's kind of on your hands, too. You could have stopped me. To really do right now i'm kind of scared why are you scared you're kind of uh, <laughs> you're kind of crazy <laughs> why do you say that you just get a bunch of creatures for no reason 
For no reason. For no reason. <laughs> I mean, they had to die, you know? What can I tell you? They did not have to die. Well, I'm telling you they did, so they fucking did, and I don't want to hear it. You got money? Uh, yeah, why? Gas up my car. Or what? Gas up my car, meow. Are you telling me this because you want to kill me or something? If I wanted to kill you, I'd dump you in a river. Gas up my fucking car. I gotta make a phone call. Hey, what's up, Denzel? Hey, I just killed uh, two animals and a human in front of him. How do you react? Uh, oh, he's... He just... He, yeah, he's, uh... Yeah, he, you know when you, you know, uh, you know when you found out about your adopted sister's aunt or whatever the fuck she is. She's not any of that, but yeah. Uh, that's how he reacted. Good. He is just Do completely shook. Well, he just. Uh, do I have permission to rough him up a bit? No. If I just told him to gas it. up my vehicle, and he said, "Or what?" So I kind of wanted to punch okay, him in his fucking cat nose. You, then fucking beat his ass. Yeah. All right. Beat him to submission like a fucking good cat would be. You know what I mean? <laughs> Waterboard his ass if we have to, then down. That's what I like to hear. All right. I'll, I'll make a man out of him. Yeah, make him a fucking man. He's too star. All right, talk to you. All right, love you, bye. Oh, we're down the street from Grape CPD. Hey, that's pretty good. Convenient. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Did you gas up my car? Know how to get money. Go gas it up. What do you have on you? What do you mean? What are you carrying? Uh, just a lockpick? Why? Not carrying a gun or a knife? No. Why not? Because I don't carry them. You lying to me? No. What happens if somebody pulls on you? Well, I guess I'm dead. Is that what you're going to do right now? Nope. Do you want to die? No. Well, then maybe you're you should carry being, something. No, you're, you're being kind of crazy right now. That's pretty good. Why isn't my car being gassed up? I don't know. Three. You're kind of a psycho. You're two, kind of a psychopath. One. Gas uh, my fucking car up now. No. Gas my fucking uh. car up. It's wrong decision. Pound that pussy cap. <laughs> Meow. Meow, I don't want to do this to you. Just gas up the fucking car. Just gas it Wait, up. Why do you have to punch me for that? Because you're mouthing off. Just do what you're told. I don't trust you. Do what you fucking told me, Al. Gas up the car. <laughs> Just go gas up the vehicle. I don't want to hurt you. Go gas up the car. Gas up the car. I'll get your bandages. I'll buy your bandages. Gas up the car. All right. Ga gas up the car. I'm freaking out right now. 
is your I feel like this is like whole being like a like a big test. You're trying to force me to like pour the gas in your car and I'm not sure if you want me to stand up myself and say no. No, I just want you to do what you're told! Gas up the fucking car! Are you fucking dumb? No, I'm freaking out. I'm, uh, is it, is it Grab the nozzle to the pump and put it in my car. I don't know. I'm freaking out right now. You're, Gas you're up the car and I'm going to get you bandages. Because you're mouthing off to me, and you have an attitude, so I hit you in your fucking cat nose. Now gas up my fucking car. Why are you trying to order me around? Because you need to learn how to follow fucking instructions. Gas up my vehicle. That's pretty good. I'm going to get you bandages if you just gas up my car. I promise not to hurt you if you gas up the car. Pinky swear. I won't hurt you if you gas up the car, yeah. Pinky swear. I'll pinky swear. Will you just listen to me, though? That's all you need to do. You pinky swear not to hurt me. If you listen, yes. Deal? I don't know. I feel like you're going to make me have to listen to, to kill somebody. Is that what this listen. is? No, you're just going to have to listen to me. Who do you love more than anything in this world? Who do I love more than anyone? Yeah. I don't know if I really love anybody. Why not? I don't know. You don't have anybody you care about? Mm. I mean, I care about a lot of people, but... I don't know if I... Like, I care about everyone, you know, but I don't think I've ever had, like, a deep personal connection with anyone specific. What about, uh, what about, what about your guilt? I like them a lot, yeah. But you don't love them? Yeah. They're not your family. So, yeah. yeah. What about uh what about the Emperor? He hates me. He doesn't hate you. Yes, he does. If he hated you, you would not be coming back from the strip. I, I knew it. You're, you're here to kill me. No, you dumbass. Get back over here. What, what are you... Okay, I just want to say... I Can I just make a point here, Meow? Yeah. Putting the car between us does not change the fact I have a gun. Okay? So just get over here. I, I can shoot your head from there. I can walk to the right and shoot you. I can shoot your head. I can literally shoot you. Me meow, I can see your ass and I can shoot you. Why would you shoot the ass? Wang over. <laughs> meow over here. You'd be full 100%. Too full. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. So you, what, 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 the emperor does not hate you. Yeah, he does. He doesn't. He doesn't like me. He doesn't. Yeah, he does. He doesn't hate you. Yeah, he does. 
He doesn't. Yeah, he does. Why do you say that? We've been fighting like the last couple weeks. Why have you guys been fighting? Oh no, he, hey. he's kind of like a... You gas up my car while we're talking and I'll, I'll grab, grab your bandages. You promise not to hurt me? I won't hurt you, pinky promise. But you also have... It, but with this pinky promise, you've also got to listen to me. A listen unless it involves hurting somebody. Unless it's mandatory. I won't hurt anybody. Any single person? Sure. Pinky swimmer. Nothing. I'm not going to hurt anything. Not going to hurt anyone. Pinky swear. Hey, not going to hurt you, and you're not going to hurt anyone. Now gas up my car, get your bandages. Hey, you ever fired a gun? Yeah. How'd you like it? It's okay. Chat, we got 20 seconds on the clock for the hype train, by the way. Mm, where are the bandages? I think they're over here. They're all that fucking expensive. Expensive ass cat. Jesus Christ, chat. What the fuck? Cheese Puffs, thank you the five bomb. Internet Tough Guy, thank you the five bomb. And Ionius, thank you the five bomb. And both, thank you the tier one. Right. Yosoka, thank you the tier one. Um, well, actually, you might, might want to grab, might want to have a bunch of bandages. <laughs> Did you gas it up? Maybe. Good boy. What is it, so what is this all about, Mr. Denzel? Check the glove box. There's a toy. And there's three bandages. Ooh, Shelly. Oh, You're the worst cop on the media. You know, it's about uh. Yeah, the worst. Yeah, by the fucking worst. <laughs> It's about just realizing that there's some things you, uh, you know you need to do. You like uh, you like grape seed? No. 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 Why not? I think I prefer to be in the city in my room. You like the city? It's okay. Who are you loyal to? My friends. Who are your friends? The guild. Anybody else? <laughs> Who? The Emperor. So you're loyal to the Emperor? Yeah. Hey. Thought, uh, I thought he hated you. He does hate me. But he doesn't. He does. 
But it doesn't. See this right here? See this? Touch this right here. Just grab it. Does it hurt? Little. I mean, I'm not. I didn't fully grip it. It's like barbed wire. Yeah, fully grip it. W wait, what? Yeah, fully grip it. Why? Just do it. Trust me. Uh huh. Does it hurt? <laughs> well, I'm trying to avoid touching the bar parts, but yeah, it kind of does. I now touch the bar part. Take a deep breath. You never know when, you know. You need a tolerance to pain me out. That's pretty good. Like for example, uh, I've been through a lot. I've done a lot of things I'm not proud of. I've done tons I am proud of. I've been kidnapped. In cuffs, taken out to the middle of nowhere, thrown in a room. Hey, that's pretty good. Come on, take a walk. I'm thrown in a room, handcuffed. You now I used to be married. Hey, I've been, uh, I've been, I've been good. put into a room before, strapped there, as they just take a blade to me. Fillet my skin slowly and slowly for days upon days upon days. And you know, at first it's the pain and it starts to break you, and all you can feel is just this sensation going down your body, and you just want to die. But you can't die, you're just suffering. And then, slowly, your mind starts to break. You're just sitting there waiting for the sweet release. Hey, that's pretty good. Now, I didn't die. You ever been in a situation like that? <laughs> hey, that's pretty good. Kind of. Are you here to kill me? Nope. Hey, that's pretty good. You've been walking a lot. How about you take a seat? To be honest, Mr. Denzel, I don't trust you. You don't trust me? No. Why not? <laughs> you want me to sit here? In yeah, why this not? chair? Come on, I'll do it with you. Ah, it's a nice seat. I'm so scared right now, Mr. Denzel. You promised, you pinky swear, not to hurt me. <laughs> Can you whistle? Yeah. He whistle Twisted Nerve? I don't know what Twisted Nerve is. <laughs> Come on. Ready? <laughs> Ready? Did you not hear me do it? No. <laughs> oh, well. Now imagine I'm here. <sighs> See these? Uh-oh. 
Yeah. Imagine I'm right here. Is anybody you hate? No. You don't hate anybody? I don't hate anyone in this city, no. But you don't love anybody either. Well, I love... Okay, define the love, because, you know, I love my friends and family, but I wouldn't say there's someone that, like... I love love, you know, because I haven't found that yet. What do you mean by love love? You know, someone that you just feel a super deep personal connection with, that you feel like you could just be yourself with at any time. <laughs> when you say love love, do you mean like marry or do you mean just somebody you can be fully open with and trust? I think fully open with and hey, trust no matter what, you know? I don't think it has to be marriage, you know? You ever use one of these? No. You know what it does? It, it shoots fire? Yep. You ever use it on somebody? No! Try. <clears throat> Alright, this is what I want you to do. Take the blowtorch. <laughs> Uh, what? Take the blowtorch. Okay. <laughs> what, what are you doing? Now, I want you to use the blowtorch on my shoulder, Meryl. Right now. No, I'm not going to hurt you. Do it! I'm not going to hurt you. You can shoot me right now. I'm not going to hurt you. You're not going to hurt me. I'm not going to hurt you. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to hurt you. I refuse. Face away no. from me. Face away from me, motherfucker. Not going to hurt me. No. If everything I've done, not going to hurt me. No. Sure? I'm sure. You sure you don't want to hurt me? I'm not going to. Take a seat. You sure you're not going to hurt me? No. I refuse. You got to sit tight and you got to think about your actions, all right? I've got this guy sat in a wooden chair. I can waterboard him right now. Are you sure you want me to do this? No, 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 no. Don't fucking waterboard him. I was just kidding. You you cannot joke with me like this. Tough laugh, Denzel. Yes, Walk I the beat the line. fuck out of him. He gassed up the car. Then I tried to get him to blowtorch me because he won't hurt anybody innocent. And I've been beating him up and he refuses to blowtorch me. So I was going to waterboard him with gasoline. Okay, just chill. Chill. Take a chill pill, all right? So you I don't want me down. to waterboard him with gasoline? No, don't fucking waterboard his ass, okay? You don't said to! I can do it, Isdale. Are you sure? I feel like I could make yes, a man I out of him. Yes, I am sure. No, tough life only. Because if I, if I waterboard him with gasoline, I'm hoping he'll waterboard me. Oh, <laughs> don't do it. It's an eye for an eye, you know. No, oh, please, I'm begging you, alright? Fine, tough we'll go life. kill something else. Alright, love you, bye. Fuck. Now, you want to know something? Okay. Do you know what this can's full of? Sugar, spice, and everything nice? Nope. Gasoline, the same thing you put in my car. Hey, that's pretty good. 
what you promised. Yep. Do you know why it's not getting pulled on you right now? Why? And why I'm not, you know, <sighs> taking that bucket, putting a rag over your face, pouring gasoline all over that rag, making you imitating drowning while the gasoline goes all over yourself, hey, making you feel cool. like you want to die. Why? It's because of the Emperor. Now let's go. Come on. Let's go. Now can you whistle that song for me, please? Without interruption? Or do I need to walk you through it again? That's pretty I mean, I did it, but you couldn't hear it. Alright, so ready? One more time. Do you need me to do it with you or no? Yep, continue. Listen, Mr. Mr. Denzel. Yeah. Please, I don't, I don't want to hurt anyone, and you clearly are a little unhinged. What makes you say that? You literally just beat the shit out of me to get me to beat the shit out of you. <laughs> And? That's a little bit crazy. You're a little. You're a little. Did I fucking ask? No. Okay. Oh. Like music? Yeah. What music do you like? Comfy music? What's comfy music? I don't know, like Animal Crossing. Um, the fuck is Animal Crossing? Candy. It's a game where you... Stimulate being an American debt. You just work for a living. Huh. But why? Because you're in debt. You're just a wage slave. But like, why would you do that? Like, why would you even... What's the point? I don't know. Hey, that's pretty good. What's your least favorite song? Um, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't really know what my least favorite song is. You ever mercy killed something? No. Would you ever take somebody's life to prevent them from being harmed? From a slow, painful death? Um, no. Because I'm not a doctor. Well, sometimes... You don't have to be a doctor to mercy kill I, I something. Think, I think you should be a doctor to mercy kill somebody. Well, sometimes to prevent somebody from being, you know... Fully harmed or hurt, you have to. See that buck to the right? Yeah. You looking at it? Yeah. Now, do you think it would feel pain if I shot it in the head? Or just yes. Quick, it would just be a quick, simple death. Please, for it. no, please don't. Stop. Just keep looking at it, meow. No, now, I'm, I'm looking away. You're looking away? I'm looking away. You're looking away. I'm looking away. Hey, that's pretty good. You looking away, meow? I'm looking away. You're looking, looking away. away. 
I'm looking away. Oh yeah. <laughs> Keep looking away, motherfucker. Keep looking away, meow. You looking away? Just fucking do it. Just do it already. You oh, killed me! God. You told me no. to do it! No. <laughs> no. You told me to do it. I thought you were going to shoot me. No. <laughs> you see, because that would be mercy kill, right? In that situation, the simple death for you would have been me shooting you. You wouldn't have to live with the consequence of your actions. Now, you saying to do it, I killed that fucking deer. It's on you. No, this is all on you. You're No, it's all twisted. on you. No, you're crazy. It's all on you, meow. No, you're crazy. No, I, no, is, I'm not no. crazy. You're the crazy you're one, fucking, meow. You're El Loco. You didn't have enough shungite all over your La Casa. And now you have the 5G waves in your head. See that guy standing there? Do you think he deserves to die? Wait, what? That guy right there, you see him? No, no. Do you think he deserves death? I don't see anyone. Death? No. You don't see anybody. You don't see this guy standing right here. No, no, no. Mm -mm. Oh my god. Two for one, meow. No, stop. Oh, do you hear those bodies? The breaking of bones. Oh look, he's suffering. Guess we'll put it out of misery. What do you think, meow? I think you need to let me out. Nope. You're not getting out. You think you can get out? Who's calling? Hey. Who's calling you, meow? Um, you know, I wish I could right now. Um. I really wish I could. Hang up the phone, Mio. Um, I have to hang up the phone now. I'm gonna kill this guy if you don't hang up the phone. Don't say a word. Just hang okay. It up. Hang it up. All right, you said a word. I am hanging up. Okay, just this guy stop. dies because you said a fucking word. Who was it? Who was it? You're never going to get that information. You're going to kill him. I'm not going to kill him if you tell me. I'll spare him no, if you tell me No, 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 no. You have no information whatsoever on who it is. Who was it? Nope. I'm going to kill this guy. Nope. I'm going to do it. No, I'm protecting him. I'm not telling you. I think I give a fuck who's on the phone. I just want to know who it is. You want to know who it is? Then you could kill him. Nope. Okay, that's fine. You want to be like that, you know. I guess we're just going to keep killing innocents until you tell me. You're the one that's killing innocents. You are with me. You know how the... You see this person behind us? You see that woman? She's probably a mother, too. You see this woman behind us? Look her in the eyes. Come on. Look at her. Look at her, meow. Stop. Give me the name or I'm going to shoot her in the head. No. Three. That's pretty good. Two. One. Wow. 
And our friend. <laughs> oh, and that guy too. All of them on you, Meow. All of them on you. Every single one of them on you. It's four dead bodies, all on you, Meow. Every goddamn one. All of them, because you wouldn't tell me who called you. Every single one. Listen. Yes. You're gonna have to kill me right. Now. Why am I? Why am I gonna have to kill you right now? I can't stand by while you're just murdering these innocents like this. Why not? fuck is he doing <laughs> what the fuck he's trying to run <laughs> he's running away hey 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 do you have a do you have a four seater mm, yeah i do me at the rooster uh, I gotta check and see is there anybody there last. that could come pick me out when I up let me check is like any of the boys we trust there uh, I think the only it's only Glorion and I here and he's got a two-seater all right the cat can get in the trunk can you tell Glorion to come up uh, yeah where do you want me to tell him to go stab city all right now right, talk to you Just remembered he uh, doesn't have a trunk. That I'll can, just uh, I'll have the cat on my someone. shoulder or something. All right. All, All right. right, I'll let him know. Hello. Yes. You're just looking at the water. I can't stand by while you're killing all these people, Mr. Denzel. You already did. You're psycho. <laughs> You're crazy. And? For what? What is this all for? I do what I have to. Do for- you have to for what? Huh? Well... Anything the Emperor wants, I do. Anything you just answer that, anything... blindly? Like I love the Emperor too, and I think in his I trust in his lo like trusting and being loyal to him as well. But I can't believe in producing innocent people like this is good for the greater good, as they cause. say. I do believe in a cause, but not like this. Well, get... the, the the ends do not justify the means. But they do. That's what I'm trying to tell just... you. Innocence will die every day. You need to just realize You're that and accept that. it. What was that? 
The ends don't justify the means. 100% do. Can you speak up a little louder? I said they 100% do. No, they don't. You don't think I... I've killed innocent plenty of times. You may have. But now you're killing all these innocent people and trying to blame me, and you're trying to... I mean, no. you're partially at fault. It's not trying not to blame you, you're just partially at fault, you know? No. Yep. I mean, you can deny it all you want. I don't give a fuck. I've already accepted. All those people? Yeah, I killed them. It's also your fault. No. Yep. You're fucking crazy. How am I crazy? Yes. I said how? You literally murdered a bunch of people. Innocent people. Yep. All you had to do was give me a name and three of them wouldn't have died. You could have saved them. But you didn't. Yet you're the guy that sits there and says you'll just take a bullet to your head. Rather than shoot somebody in self-defense. However, you could yeah. have simply saved all three of those people. Innocent. Completely innocent if you are just giving me a name. You didn't. And all three no, of those because you're gonna no. kill that person. You're gonna kill that person. You literally no, said, "Who is that?" You're gonna kill them. Nope. I wouldn't have killed them. I don't trust you whatsoever. Okay. Your words are meaningless to me because you're you're literally crazy, unhinged. Promises mean nothing to you. Yeah, they do. No, they don't. You yeah, already broke do. a pinky pro. You already broke a pinky promise. Well, then I'd hurt you. Yeah. You wouldn't hurt me, so I had to. Yeah, you broke it. And? You're untrustworthy. You think that if you want. Yo, man, man, they need a twenty bomb. You can think I'm untrustworthy. I'm sure if you ask any of your guild or any of the emperors, they tell me, you know, they tell you that they trust me with their lives. So you can think what you want. Think I give a fuck about you, you some worthless fucking cat that can't even take a life. Oh, if you really think that, then put a bullet in my head right now. Yeah, I wish I could. <laughs> what do you mean you wish you could? I said I wish I could. You worthless fuck. And actually... I told you to hurt me, and you wouldn't do it. So in reality, you didn't listen to me. Maybe you should have listened. What no, because I said, did you just spit in my face? Yeah, I fucking did, because you're a worthless fuck. Like, man, I know you're a pussy, but Jesus Christ, you really are a fucking pussy. You're sitting there crying just because you're looking at somebody fucking dying. Imagine having to pull the trigger on somebody. How, how are you going to hold up then? Because that wouldn't on someone. You know what? Your actions have really shown me that the guild really isn't all that. You guys are crazy. You can tell them that I could. I'm leaving. Oh, no! Langa <laughs> needs to pick the fuck up. I had to fucking cap him. Fuck.
God damn it, Lang! Oh my god! Fuck. He probably wanted one of these. No, he's just sitting there. Fuck, he's on the phone. Fuck me. Hey, that's pretty good. Dude, I really don't want to have to cap him. Yo, these fucking guys. We're down the road from Skooma. We're down the road from Skooma. Yeah, uh, Bjorn's already on his way. Okay, I... We've got a, we got like, an emergency right now. Alright, alright. Uh, Meow just told me he's leaving the guild. What the hell happened? What did you guys do? I was trying to break him. Okay? All and right, he is well, leaving the guild. He said they're all crazy, and he's leaving. He is running away from me and calling people. I am chasing him on foot. Alright, uh... There's a mountain lion! Hang up the phone! Are you okay? No! It's <laughs> running away from him! What the fuck? The mountain lion's running from him? It's on his side. He's like, they know they're, they're working together. What the fuck? I, I don't know what to do here, Glory. My natural reaction is to kill, kill me out. But I, I can't. Are you... Do you still have your your things? Are you able to cuff him? I, I can, but I gotta get close to him. Okay, okay. Let me see if I can call him or call Bjorn. Call him, call him. Alright, alright, alright. Hey, that's pretty good. Meow, get out of the... Psst, psst, psst. Where the fuck did he go? I can't tell if he's in that bush. He's down the street. Now I'm not gonna hurt you. <laughs> Meow, 
Meow, I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm right here. I'm not gonna hurt you. If I was gonna hurt you, you'd already be dead. This motherfucker. This motherfucker. Oh my fucking god. Dump that shit in the ocean. Dude, I can't believe Lion didn't pick up the phone. Fuck me. I could have just shot him in the back of the head. Hello? Hey, where This are motherfucker you? just ratted on me. Who did? Who the fuck do you think? Meow, yeah, I don't know what happened. Uh, I just, uh, I got pulled over by a city guard. And then they just pulled up and started talking to me. I told them I was looking for Meow, and they said, uh, that if I wanted to hear more about it, I should go to Mission Row. And I guess they said he might need medical. I'm, a, I'm across, uh, you, okay, you know the little, you know the little dot? What's your number? I gotta ping you. I need a pickup. Uh, four, three, five. Did you get that? <laughs> Alright, I'll be there in a few. Alright. Alright, well...